I have my BSI on. Can I have your inhaler? I have a meter dose inhaler prescribed to Rachel Kirksick, uh, prescribed by Dr. Ogden and expires 1010 of 2010. I'm going to shake the canister and warm it my hand to room temperature. I'm going to replace it into here and check the connection. I'm going to check my six rights. I have the right patient, right medication, right dose, right route, right time, and right documentation. I'm going to go ahead and contact medical control. Medical control, this is advanced EMT Yardley. I have a 36-year-old female patient who is experiencing difficulty breathing. She does have an, an inhaler that is, is prescribed to her and is not expired. May I go ahead and administer one meter dose per protocol? Go ahead and administer one meter dose per protocol. Copy that. I will administer one meter dose per protocol. Okay, Rachel. <clears throat> when I tell you, I'm gonna, or I'm gonna remove your oxygen, and then I'm gonna have you blow out all your air. I'm gonna count to three. I'm gonna squirt this into your mouth, and have you make a good seal, and then hold your breath as long as you can. Hold that in there, okay? Okay. So go ahead and remove the patient's oxygen. Okay. Go ahead and make a good seal. Blow out all your air. One, two, three. Go ahead and hold that in there as long as you can. I'm going to replace the patient's oxygen. I'm going to go ahead and re record the time of the medication given as well as the route and dose. Do you feel like that is helping you at all? Yeah, it's easier to breathe. Okay, good. So I'm going to continue to monitor my patient's breathing throughout transport, and I'm going to transport as a high priority and reassess while on route.